This competition alone does not mean that we should feel bad if we have not made it, nor must we have hate for others that might have been those that are going to be winners and succeeders. But it is a competition that will need each and every one of us to take part in and make sure that we build a solidified foundation, particularly for the team that will go and represent us with other institutions further on into the province and the nation. I would like to greet you all this morning and welcome you to this special event. Welcome our college principal, uh, our lecturers from other campuses, our panel of judges, and our wonderful students. These are people who are working behind the scenes. And in most cases, they don't get recognition. Guys, these are, your, these are our lecturers who made it possible, Lugut Sizela, made the best campus or a team win. And my dear students, these are the words of encouragement that you need to have, you need to live with so that you will be able to participate fully in this debate. Good luck to the participation teams. You are all winners in my eyes. Thank you. Now, let us begin with what is going to happen. Uh, the communication that I had with judges is that when teams are called to debate, we will not be taking points of information during the debate. In front of us, we have Mr. Pilasan de Shomuga. Our second judge is Dr. Pel Mzuli. Last but not least, Dr. Mzwandi Lekumalo Mdungwa. The motion for today is online learning is replacing traditional classroom. And as Team Umalanga, we firmly believe indeed some students adapt faster than others. And when you are in a traditional classroom, a teacher is able to notice or identify those students that aren't adapting or grasping that subject that is learning in time. Online learning will never, ever replace traditional learning because us as students, we tend to compete with each other and that is increasing the pass rate of the school. The first world countries are not where they are overnight. They started somewhere. At some point, first world countries didn't have network, also did not know how to operate computers, but they are where they are today because they started at some point. And the truth of this matter is the one-size-fits-all approach of the traditional classroom is slowly losing its touch. During the same time, 11,315 rape cases were reported. Where are the arrests? How many have been arrested? What are the stats? I haven't heard you guys tell us any of that. Sometimes it's not the government, it's us. Us, we are the ones who are not doing much. Like reporting these cases, we need to look at the devil in the eyes and start reporting this animal we call our partners. The winners of this year's debate competition are Kwamash. <laughs> Two speakers will come rather from two colleges or rather two campuses, which will be Impumalanga campus. And this would be the third speaker of Impumalanga campus. And then the other recommended candidate whom we feel is capable enough to represent the college comes from Gadi campus. The debates competition 22 edition Elangene College is finally closed. Thank you, thank you contestants 
Thank you everyone.